All right, we're back at it again. We got episode three up in here. Um, I'm definitely gonna get to like the nitty gritty. I did a lot of side quests on my last playthrough, so without further ado, let's just we're not even we're not even intro. Let's go, let's go. So I gotta talk to Professor Hecate. So I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you would. You are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. All right. You know where to find me once you've finished. I got to do crossed wands and I have to do... It seems crossed wands isn't as secret as it's believed to be. See Luke and that'll be... Handy resources. Oh yeah, that's easy. Ready for another round? Oh yeah, let's get it. We shall see who shows up. There's no one in the school I'd be afraid to duel. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training? Oh, that is not what I wanted to do. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? No. Actually, I might come back later. Suit yourself. I'll be around when you're ready. All right, for real, though. There we go. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of crossed ones all set? Ah, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Absolutely. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? No. I'll be dueling solo. Then let's get to it. I feel like I'm going to regret that. Ready to get thrashed? Don't bow at me. Don't do that. Apologies in advance. And you sound like you're eight years old, so... Alright, break through body shields with four spells. Okay. Alright. Okay, why did my shit just do that? Yeah. Gotta look at so many things actually. Drop him. Okay. Oh, I did not even see that. Who wants to smoke? Stupid get off me. I don't know what this electricity shit is. Awkward. Alright, there we go. Get off me. Come here. There we go. Hey, hey. That hasn't no, no. Three on one? My gosh. Wait, somebody was betting against me? That's crazy. Bravo. I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. Just bring it. You better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning. <laughs> or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Does that mean like death Thanks or see you like... Then. Wait, what? The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Can I do it now? Or no? I have to do Hello, it. Hello, Lucan. I'm ready for practice. Glad you're keeping at it. Ready to have a try now? Should probably read my quest that stuff. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. 
If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. <clears throat> I got you, I got you. Alright. Alright. Full combo action. So, three, A. Excellent four. Nikki will probably agree. Oh, that's dirty. Okay. Okay. I see the refresh rate on some of that stuff. Practice. You looked good out there. Makes sense. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. Like You'll be that. a fearsome challenger now. It's the smartest five-year-old I've ever met in my life. Assignment's all finished. So now I just go back to Professor Hackett, I'm assuming. What's up? Perhaps I should stick to potions. Yeah, perhaps you should. Okay, we'll go back to Professor Hackett. Let's learn that uh, incendio. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavors. Aren't I a fifth year? Why am I not taller I than her? Am I short? You gave me Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn incendio. I've been ready. You should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say, I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that fire is a fickle Yo, servant. that's no lie. I literally almost burned the kitchen down with a paper towel the other day. Thus far, so, but please, I feel this. Maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. I would and also remember, not focus like that. on the proper wand movement. Yeah, let's see guy. And keep oh, just a trial? Steady. Your okay. easy. I learned enough that I need to equip, and I got to swap. Good work. Okay. I don't feel like I'm using Reparo for shit. We'll go there, I guess. Right. Yeah, that's fine. All right, I have some rewards available, but we're just gonna we're gonna move on to the next thing, which is what exactly? I don't know. It's heavy damage spell that unleashes destructive flames at short range. Love to hear that. Wait. Damn, I really just sat on the floor ah, like that? That was are. sad. Damn. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Hackett. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. Yo, let's burn that so, bitch down. Shall we proceed? Just kidding. Fig, I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule... Your schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. Damn. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office. Five okay. minutes. I will hold grudges. Wow. Big man there. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. Or... But professor, we have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to go talk to the homie Sebastian. What up? Sebastian, there you are. There you are. You promised me an explanation for what happened in the three broomsticks. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? I've never even met him. Perhaps he mistook me for another student. If you say so. 
I won't press you now, but you will have to tell me what's going on at some point. I will never tell. You might need me. So, why were you looking for me? I need to find something for Professor Fig, but it's in the restricted section of the library. <laughs> he can't get it himself? He was called away by Black at the last moment. I suppose I could wait to get a note from him, but... You want to show some initiative? Precisely. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight. Love to hear it. And tell no one. What will happen if we're caught in the restricted section? Detention, no doubt. But a word of caution or two will help. For one, avoid Peeves, the poltergeist. That feels annoying. Aside from wanton destruction of property, he loves nothing more than telling on the likes of us. Huh. How concerned should I be about the librarian? Madam Scribner doesn't take kindly to clandestine activities taking place amongst her precious clandestine? books. Clandestine? So do all that you can to avoid her. She and Yo, I have these had words in this game? But I can hold my own against her. You may not be so lucky. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. Alright. So meet him at night. Is, is it already night time? Or... Okay, that was easy. Was <laughs> shit. Ah. See there? That's the door we need to reach. Okay. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Freaking prefects. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are cloak? expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a try. All right. Disillusionment. All right, so we got to go here and we'll uh get rid of lumos for now use disillusionment to avoid being detected in off limit areas all right oh they're right there okay oh this is funny nearby adversaries will sense and then investigate being caught by authority figures will result in quest failure. I shall pretend I cannot see you. Oh, shit. Am I just going to stay this way for a while, or...? Damn, they're everywhere. What the hell? Okay, how do I get in the door, though? They're talking. Oh, there we go. There's no way this will work. Did that actually worked. gone by now i said usually but it'll still be all right do you see her desk behind me the key is in the drawer of that desk now here's what we're going to do i'll create a distraction to draw her away you focus on getting the key i'll meet you outside of the restricted section yeah. wait why do we need a key isn't there a spell for this hello homora that's how i always used to get in but the librarian twigged that I knew the spell and cast an anti Alohomora charm on the lock. I need Alohomora. So now it's just this key. Bad. But don't worry. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. Alright.
She just looks evil. What is happening? There's someone there. Is that you, Greaves? Better not. The library is no place for larking about. Out at once. <laughs> okay. I didn't think she was going to walk that way. All right, let's try this again. You would think she would walk straight up backwards, but she decided to walk that way, which is really goofy. made that way more difficult than it had to be. That wasn't so difficult after all. How to find that book. not down here though right oh there's a treasure chest though oh that one's charms look more useful than it is it's fooled me twice never judge a tome by its cover i say facts maybe downstairs it's a basic cast while undetected to lure authority figures to a desired location ghost all right we go i see you Okay. Oh, pay attention to that. Good ghosty. Is she gonna see me? That one right there? I'm just gonna hurry up. Should be in the clear. There we go. There's no need for us to be skulking about. Alright. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No, we've tried everyone from Nurse I wonder what's up with the sister. Mongos. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. What's that red arrow the on the map right there? What the hell? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. What the fuck was that about? Okay. I'm been slacking on my Revelio usage, actually. Revelio. Celestial blue. Oh, this douchebag. Come on, man. You'll get caught. Peeves, don't you? I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. What a bitch. For real. Oh, blast That's crazy. I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse. I don't appreciate that at all, actually. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Sebastian's an OG. I like is what he's really trying to say. In my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. I mean, I don't like all that, but... Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? Alright. Just a spell to repair this armor. So now I was talking all kinds of shit about repair. 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 Oh, this is a dungeon dungeon. Rebellion. Of course, traces of ancient magic. Huh. There 
must be more to this room. I feel like I don't have gear to hold. Was I able to grab that? I was. Okay. That's it. Okay, it's fancy. Okay, you know what? I keep replacing stuff with stuff that I need. I don't want this. Lumos. Oh yeah. Yes. All right, what do we got here? Lumos. We got here. Revelio. Obviously. Ah, I need to wake up that rune over there. What the fuck? Accio. Incendio. Okay, obviously it's something I don't have equipped currently. Let's try this. Levioso. I wonder if I can hit the room with a spell. Right. I also wonder that as well. Like. Incendio. L2 to free aim. Yeah, I got you. What the hell's going on? Okay. What else do I have? I don't really have anything else. Maybe if I just I wonder if do this. Can hit the room with a spell. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh shit, alright. Guards at the ready. Guards at the ready. Oh my gosh, the ancient magic is crazy. Oh my god, I did not even see this man. Didn't mean to do that. Alright. You really gotta be close for that. Wow. You get the ancient magic accumulates by successfully attacking or taking damage. And it combos will begin generating power ups, collecting them will greatly fill your ancient magic meter and recover health. Okay. Noted. When at least one segment of your meter is full, you can cast devastating attacks. I gotta get better at fighting for real. Rebellion. Same thing? Alright. Okay. Sounds like Voldemort's in here. Probably just equip stuff that's attack related, right? I mean, I guess I have everything that's that. Alright, there we go. That's not bad. Alright. Figuring it out. Okay, obviously hitting this is gonna help me get across. What about the other stuff? Okay. Oh my goodness, I'm about to fall off. Alright. 
Lumos. Oh, I just will have to deal with not knowing what's over there. Unless that's nothing. Okay. Revelio. I feel like I want to know how to get over there. Accio. That don't work. Okay. I'm glad there's no like you can't like die from falling because that would have been a wrap for me already. It's obviously something I want to get. Also, you gotta love them. This must be the way forward, but to where? Exactly. Okay. A couple different ways here as well. Who's that? They're gonna go away. Interesting. Okay. Oh, this is fancy. Alright. Okay, see, I found a way to get this one. There's got to be a way to get the last one, but I feel like I can't even equip that, right? Or yes, technically I can, but it's green. Which I'm not feeling. Let's try to see if we can get back to what we were getting before. Ah. Lumos. There's got to be a way to get this, right? I'm not crazy. Ah, just straight up, just like this, okay. Yo, <laughs> okay, uh, at least I can search this one again. Let's destroy what we just got. I think it was, yeah, what does this do? Can't upgrade it though, but it does upgrade offense, but like, I don't want things you can't upgrade. Crimson winter coats. Alright. Oh my. <laughs> Alright, this is cool though. This is cool. I like this. I like this. Alright, let's go over here now. about me absolutely okay this gear slot thing is gonna piss me off i feel like i have so many good things like why would i ever like get rid of what i have currently i can i'd rather sell it than you know what i mean like what, what about this It's like all the stuff I'm getting is the stuff I don't want. Scholar's robe. Do I want this? Probably not. The music got like really friendly just a little bit ago. It's well appointed, but no, I'm good on that. Okay. 
the Lux House Club. See, that was the one you want. All right, we got some drama over here. Are y'all all gonna come to life? Probably. Okay, who else wants to smoke? Really, you're coming from the sky like that. It's crazy. Get off me. Don't touch me. Yeah, that's somebody came from behind. Okay. Why not? That is not what I meant to do. Oh, I pressed like a block button. Like I'm playing a different game. Oh my gosh. I had a dude behind me too, so that's problematic. <laughs> I gotta stop doing the most. I'm almost about to die like every encounter. Patience is really bad. Is there anything? No, it doesn't look like it. All right. It is a book after all. I just book by itself, huh? To the pensive. I'd be scared to like put my head in this and then you pull it out and like somebody's in front of you like boogity boogity you know Just helping out the people like that? Okay. All right, kid. Little grumpy ass little girl, man. Okay. You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morganoff, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, 
Professor Rackham can see them too. But we've never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see Hogwarts traces of ancient good. magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. <coughs> but let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganach. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. This, this story is on repeat. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. She's so happy. <laughs> She's so giddy. So giddy. So giddy. I would be too. Exclusivity is real. And all of a sudden, I'm out of there? I'm still tripping off that treasure chest I didn't open. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take Peeves this is to such the headmaster. A bitch. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. I can tell you nothing. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> Seriously, Peeves needs to be dealt with, like, today. Let's see what he's got for us. Tomes and tribulations. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, fig. You have a visitor. Sorry, man, you better back up, out. son. Yeah. Yeah, get out of here. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Hopefully, Shadow Clone Jutsu is in there. That would be nice. Oh. oh dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still. I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm, perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the Ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My Which is crazy. is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. 
Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. Oh, thank but you. But you'll want to pay attention in thank herbology you. and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. Potions, for sure. I seeing all that you've become <clears> when <throat> I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. You got it. All right, I have some challenges that I've... Let's go look at that real quick. Claim that. Claim that. And I think that's it, right? Okay. About here, is there anything to claim here? like gear appearance stuff okay right, let's see what we got in lower hogsfield as soon as possible i would like to talk to you about rookwood and harlow and it might be best to do so outside of the castle okay level one i was wondering why i haven't gotten that professor Haggard's assignment too so we got a couple new quests professor fig and weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you and then proceed to see me in my classroom. All right. Ninety Central and Outpost, Question Meter and Lowers, Oxfield, the Hamlet. Okay. Select the world map button and switch to the world map. Oh, wow. Hamlets are small communities throughout the world. Lower Hogsfield. We provide new opportunities for vendors, food games, side quests, and collectibles. Okay. As you explore, you remove fog and reveal more of the map, unveiling new opportunities. Like Hamlets, dungeons, bandit camps, and many other locations. All right. Let's go uh, learn the spell. That's more intrigued by that. Well, yeah, let's go, let's go learn the, uh, let's go learn the spell. Successfully avoid enemy attacks by dodge, cast, and deal on enemies. How the f do I go do that? You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was. She's acting like I can just go do that. Oh, maybe that's how I do it. Go to cross rounds three, I guess. And then I gotta cast incendio on enemies. Do like my own classmates count or like so many questions I have. Okay, let's we'll see what we can do. Chill out. All right. All right. Let's practice with the training dummy, I guess. Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit okay. more of a challenge. Ready? That'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. All right, bet. Let me make sure I have what I need here. So I think I need this for sure. All right. Okay. That's it. Nice little combo. I like ran out. I like ran out. You gotta have to be slower with what I'm doing. Incendium. 
Okay, yeah. Just want to be more patient. That makes that makes some more sense. Impressive wand work. I take to face. Never act like I'm playing Street Fighter or Mortal Kombat or something. Thanks, Lucan. You've been a great Lucan's help. dope. Oh, stop! Don't make for being blush. four years old. Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Plus, you'll be even more formidable in crossed ones. Other duelists had better beware. Yeah, this combo's kind of go crazy, low key. Okay. Quest updated. Yeah, I'm trying to track that. Successfully avoid any attacks by dodge rolling. Is that the only thing I need to do? So I guess that that'll be good to do in Hello, cross Lincoln. ones. Is the final round of cross ones ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. I mean, Ready for a shot at glory? I have a lot of dedication. I certainly Absolutely. Am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Nah. I'll go it alone. Then let's get So I got to dodge, okay. Am I going 3 on 1 again though? We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. Wait, hold up. There's not four, four of these fools. There's no way. One on, okay, maybe I should have grabbed a partner. So break through red shields with damage spells like fire, like incendio. Okay, th okay, this is a sketch. Okay, well, first of all, I need to dodge. Okay. I don't know who's doing what. Okay. Shit. Why am I on the wrong person? Okay. I'm just really not trying to die, but I think I'm about to. Okay, so I see what's happening. They're doing it like a bunch of times, so like <laughs> instead of trying to dodge so much, I just gotta like to try again? guard. Yeah. Ah, oh, it's okay. It's like tough to dodge and then especially when you have four, like I need to get rid of a couple of them yeah, before. Very well. Good luck. Oh my god. Hey yo. Okay. Care to try again? Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. Good luck out there. Thank goodness you can actually keep going. My goodness. All right. Okay. Taking so much damage. Fuck. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay. Ooh, I dodged that. Care to try again? Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. Good luck out there. I'm trash. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, I didn't see the other one. Care to try again? Give my ass whoops. Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. That's what I get for going by myself. Alright. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to aim on that, that's for sure. Oh, you can't. You can't really do stupefy because Care to try again? you can't poise through that. Yes, I'm ready now. Oh. Okay, 
about to die again. <laughs> I think I need to focus more on like one person for real. Ah, oh, she's doing regular magic. Oh damn, the black girl's the most annoying one. Can I get rid of her first? Oh my gosh. I don't mind Love you also. Yeah, let's get the black girl out the way. Oh my gosh. What is the range on that? Okay, she's dropped. Sick her old boy. Alright, there we go. Oh, shit. Okay, there we go. Oh my gosh, though. Why was I getting smacked up so bad? What a victory! You won the tournament! After 70 tries. God. I got lucky. It was mostly luck, that's all. Please. You wouldn't have got this far on luck alone. That's bad. Now, to the victor goes the prize! I'm proud to be talking and about. And so it is my great honor to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment. I'm flattered, but I don't deserve such an honor. Come now, you're the undisputed winner. You should revel in your accomplishment. I'm humble, baby. Now that we've definitively I'm crowned humble. the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. Bro, you're gonna fail. What are you doing? Yes. Alright. The best jewelist won, I suppose. Yeah, y'all did like 50 times. Okay, I think I can go back to Professor Hackett. Hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. I have. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. But spell casting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. There you go. Love to see it. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Yeah, why not? You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. 
Very honest. Maybe you'll so laugh one day. Instead, you. Levioso. Accio. Incendio. All right. Now what else can we do from a quest perspective? Obviously, that was a, like a big quest, but. Okay, that's let's go to our herbology class. Like I like, turn. I, I wish I could find some more keys, but it's not like they track those for you. So it's like, can't really do this. Technically speaking, it's just it's like passive, right? But yeah, let's hit up herbology class. Oh, we got a cute teacher. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora, dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Okay. Oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. Okay. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together. Oh, I love the braided pigtails, not gonna lie. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacula than the bouncing ball. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? First, let's protect our ears. Oh, that would suck. Now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. Um, Rapero? Goodness gracious. The soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature. I was about to say. All right then. Off you go. Bad boy. Splendid work, everyone. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have. Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like knot grass. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. I'll say. Nearly went deaf. Well, yes. Of course, the cry of a mature mandragora can be fatal. So remember to keep those ears protected. Oh, no. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick yeah. them up in Hogsmeade. Professor Carl can the absolutely get it. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's huh? see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Nithla's fancy. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wigan Wells potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Growth time is 10 minutes. Lots of any size, okay. 
Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in the Wigan Weld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Um, Come back and see me when you're finished. I'll oh, just give Pruitt the hands. Fingers. They do bite. Okay. Leander Pruitt, Hello. what up? Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But your lead. He was looking at me when you're talking to me, but it's cool, bro. Defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me. Your duel with Sebastian, and he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good, but you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Oh. Thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, here we are, home of the Chinese. He's Chinese about to say some crazy shit. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it. They'll do the rest. Okay. How the fuck do I do that? Oh. They'll chomp on anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Yeah. Vicious little bastards, pretty cool. aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I'm not about. saying you can't go it alone. But, well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos I'll take it. There. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. And Dog eating them too. Death cap has more They're healthy for you. Peen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head I'm, back to I'm class. very intrigued by potions and herbology. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. All right, good. And all these leaves were used in potion stuff, it looks like. I'm excited to go to potions class. Ooh, a blue cap sight. I don't want that. And with that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clark. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. Missing digits? I'm good, as you do seem to be quite green fingers. I need her digits. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in I'm, the soil continue to blossom. I'm sorry. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my <coughs> new students. I, I will definitely be back. Absolutely. Absolutely. Just look at you. Green, uh, green's your color. Alright. So that's got some time. I wonder... Hmm. I'm gonna go to Ocean's class. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. Tell me more. 
You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Point for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a wig and weld potion of your own. Good. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. He gives me like alcoholic vibes, but also kind of cool. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. Fork lump. Okay. The big ass ladle. God dang. All right. This reminds me of Mario Party. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your what recent you exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Don't worry, I got you, dog. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more resourceful. Come and see me when you like finish that. brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. If you run out of ingredients, I simply grow most of what I need. Okay. My Wigan Well potion's utter rubbish. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. Bro, nobody was actually talking to you. Like, I'm Professor not even gonna lie. Sharp said that Wigan Well potion can treat injuries. Hope I never need it. Okay. Collect Ashwinder eggs and collect dark mongrel fur from his office. I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office. To Weasley. He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Nobody cares. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, are you related Griffin to Griffin Dora's boy? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single whooper feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad side. Yeah, you like, bro. Whooper feathers aren't that valuable. I'm not even Sharp trying to, bro, like, like, no. I have enough to worry about collecting the ingredients he wants me to get. I'm afraid I can't help you. I understand. I'll sort something else out. Can you remind me what you needed again? I was hoping you could get me a oh. whooper feather from Sharp's office. It's the last ingredient I need to complete my potion. Remember, precision is key. Morgan and Burks has had an increased amount of activity outside of our ordinary shop hours, particularly in the wee hours of the night. Given what we know about the shop's reputation, we're adding more ores to join us that have already been watching this shop. You are amongst the new additions. Oh shit, he's an R too? What the?
Lucian should not be that color, Miss McDowell. Gareth. Hello again. Here's the fruit feather you wanted. Knew you'd come around. Brilliant. Thank you. This is going to take a moment to brew. Man. You should get back to brewing your endurance. He's lucky. I love Fred and, and George. This concoction's finished. All right, bro. I got respect for the Weasleys. For real. All right. Should you chop the didney or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss All of right. your eyebrows. Brewing time is 30 seconds. So just kind of out of way here for a little bit. Add the mallow sweet and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Bro, what are you doing? What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Dude. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. Nah, man, I answered shit. Wasn't expecting that literally to blow up in my face. It was rather brilliant, though. I'd better clean up. You should finish brewing your potion if you haven't already. Yeah, yeah. Dude, what? This man's getting me in trouble, man. That's crazy. Should have kept the, uh, the feather for myself, honestly. Brewed an endurance potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. My bad. <laughs> I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. I did, my bad. As for the work you did today in your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student i'm glad i was able to meet your expectations a rare occurrence and you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet oh, but i will be in addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves will do pay particular attention in herbology the plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Noted. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. All right, my bad, man. I'm, I'm really sorry again about Weasley. I think oh. each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Might as well make another one of these. That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. Heard him talking about taking responsibility. Professor Sharp was annoyed, but we sorted it out. No harm. Cheers to that. He probably had a good chuckle after we left. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. 100%. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise. Fewer explosions. All right. So we're all good there. What is that over there? Like, what is happening? To see a creature get put down like that, but trolls have no business. All right, now, now, what to do? What to do? There's so much to do. All right, there's actually not a lot to do. Let's meet with uh, Natty. These uh, remind me of Zelda, those like balloon things. I 
This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. What's that? I'm down to fight whatever. It is good to see you, my friend. What's up? Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm. A bit odd. The two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so Get out my business. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Why? Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Do you think that? Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Hollow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. Okay. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Hollow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili Land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Okay. Good. Rookwood and Hollow are a dangerous pair. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with their students. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the Why we? It makes you think I want to do this. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. I still don't trust her. I really don't trust anybody. Being honest. What are you up to now? I beg your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? I was gonna say, what is what's happening over there? Help the stranger. I could do that. All right, here we go. It's also a side quest right there, but let's uh, let's help him out. This way. Think. Dark wizard. Oh I shit, it's like that. You think I might have seen? I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a doxy's nip back your time. A doxy's I... nip? Speak of the devil, Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. You don't know me. Student, you can't be so... <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Oh shit, we got it's like that. Some sort of dark magic, I presume. You'll pay for that. Alright, get out of here. Okay. I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. You gonna do shit. Okay. You know where to hide. We can hurt the top. I'm not going anywhere with you. Stop stop. Here. Send. That's just careful. All right. I'm just going to take care of you real quick. 
But we got time for all that. Dueling feats complete the battle in 12 seconds. I've never been accosted in such a manner. Been so close to Hogwarts. Bro, I don't even know. What did I just do? What about a dueling feat? Let's look at that. I'm glad that we've unlocked this now. I don't know what they were talking about. What do we have here, though? Okay, what about them? It says they're quicker. They will surprise with back to back. The powerful reductor curse cannot be blocked by shields, but interrupting it with the severing one will spin them to the point of losing control and hitting one of their own gang. Okay. Loaded. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. I was all Can offense. Can you tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rockwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story. I'm so handsome. Thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You mentioned someone named Priya? Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin, gave me a book when we were students at Hogwarts. Typical yeah. hardworking Hufflepuff, brilliant potioner, has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. But she's a I'm traveling there. vendor. I'm there. what's going on in the Highlands before I do. You're a researcher. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. I think it's just extraordinary. Merlin? Of the legend of King Arthur. The very same. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, That's and cool. I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I'd love to do those. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond Merlin of puzzles and enigmas. Good. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more. I wonder if, they, if he's always a Slytherin well, or if it's whatever house secret. you pick. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. Probably but ancient I magic. I have just unlocked a crucial clue. Tell me more. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet. Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. Okay. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You were rudely interrupted, that, yeah. Each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little... Yeah, I'm trying to get some more gear, so let's do it. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Mm -hmm. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Sweet on the swell, and we'll see what happens. All right, this is like a teleportation pad or something. My word, did you see that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious. Incendio. Merlin's beard. The flames make the pyre sink. There we go. Pretty dope. What 
today I can hardly believe it. Now what? I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. All right. My guess is that each will also require mallow suit, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I Appreciate you. must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you too. And do be careful out here. Now I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and book. Oh yeah, we take what we can get over here. Different challenges offer different rewards. Complete more than trial challenges to increase your gear capacity. All right, I've gone to a couple classes. I've done a couple things, but um, I think this is going to conclude part three for me. If you're still around, I appreciate y'all being here. And uh, stay tuned for part four. I'll see you when I see you.